क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी सेवन सी वाई टू थाउजेंड एंड ट्वेंटी काउंट द टोटल नंबर ऑफ पैरल जी लाइन्स एक्सपेक्टेड इन द ई पी एस स्पेक्ट्रम ऑफ सोल्यूशन ऑफ बीस सेलिसाइलाल डिमिन कॉपर टू हैविंग ए प्योर सिक्सटी थ्री फोर्टीन एन एंड वन इंच एट सेवेंटी सेवन के लोविन गिवेन द न्यूक्लियर स्पिन और द आई वैल्यूज ऑफ सिक्सटी थ्री कॉपर फोर्टीन एंड वन इंच आर थ्री बाई टू वन एंड हाफ रेस्पेक्टिवली दिस इज अ न्यूमेरिकल टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन सो नो ऑप्शन इज गिवेन नो कमिंग टू द आंसर बिफोर डूइंग एनी न्यूमेरिकल कैलकुलेशन वी हैव टू नो फ्यू थिंग्स फर्स्ट ई पी आर ई पी आर और इलेक्ट्रॉन पैरामैग्नेटिक रेजन स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी इज वन काइंड ऑफ एब्जॉर्बन स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी वैर डिफरेंट एनर्जी लेवल्स आर प्रोड्यूस्ड ड्यू टू द इंटरक्शन बिटवीन मैग्नेटिक मोमेंट ऑफ एन अनपेयर इलेक्ट्रॉन इन ए मॉलिकुलर आयोन विद द अप्लाइड स्टार्टिंग मैग्नेटिक फील्ड इलेक्ट्रॉन हैविंग अ चार्ज एंड रिवॉल्विंग अराउंड एन ऑर्बिट इन एन अनपेयर्ड इन एन अनपेयर्ड एनवायरमेंट विल डेफिनेटली प्रोड्यूस अ मैग्नेटिक फील्ड नाउ इफ यू कीप द इलेक्ट्रॉन इन एन एक्सटर्नल मैग्नेटिक फील्ड द टू मैग्नेटिक फील्ड दैट इज द मैग्नेटिक फील्ड कमिंग फ्रॉम द रिवॉल्विंग चार्ज इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड द एक्सटर्नल मैग्नेटिक फील्ड विल इंटरेक्ट अलॉन्ग ईच अदर एंड फॉर्म डिफरेंट एनर्जी लेवल्स नाउ in that different energy levels electronic transition is possible and because of this electronic transition a per epr spectrum will arise another thus because of this electron transition another name of epr is esr which is electron spin resonance spectroscopy there are four cases where eps spectrum will arise the first one is atoms having odd number of electrons second one ions having partly filled inner electronic shell third one is free radical having unpaired electron and last one is molecule with paired electrons and zero magnetic field so in the question the given compound is this salicyl dimin salicylal dimin copper 2 the structure of the compound will be okay which contains one copper two ion two nitrogen atom and two hydrogen atom okay we will look one by one first copper That is sixty three copper, fourteen n and one h. These values are mass numbers. That is the number of neutron plus the number of electrons will be twenty nine seven and one. This is. number of electrons we can see in each case the number is odd in every case the number is odd now think of copper 2 plus iron it has 27 electrons which is again odd number and the configuration will be 3d9 Four is zero, so 
the partly filled inner orbital so in case of copper both this first points that is atoms having odd number of electrons and ions having partly filled inner electron count is obeyed both in case of copper atom and copper to ion in case of nitrogen and hydrogen the first point that is atoms having odd number of electron is obeyed thus all these atoms that is 63 copper 14 and 1 each are epr active and because of their presence the complex itself is epr active So this is the so this is the structure of the compound. The ligand is salicyl. Lalimine. The charge is minus one. Total charge of ligand is minus two because there are two ligands, and Catonic charge is plus two. Thus, complex become neutral. So the complex is neutral, and because of the presence of copper, nitrogen, and hydrogen, it is EPR active. Now, from the hyperfine interactions, that is splitting of EPR signal by neighboring nuclei. We can determine the par parallel G lines in the spectrum by the equation of two n i plus one, where n equals to number of nuclei and i equals to nucleus spin. Now. Nucleus spin values, I for sixty three copper is three by two. For fourteen n is one, and for one h it is half. We will draw the structure again one more time. Okay. So we will count for each of these atoms, and then we will multiply. It. That is, the n value. N for copper is one. N for nitrogen is two, and N for hydrogen. Just copper. This one, one into three by two plus one. Okay, this is the copper. Then 
nitrogen these two nitrogens are there so two nitrogen two value okay now for hydrogen hydrogen value is two the two hydrogens are there so two into two into half plus one this is four into this is five into and this is three this value is sixty this is your answer for more elaborate discussions and numerical calculation you can look into the lecture on ESR spectroscopy module 11 lecture 55 ESR spectroscopy 3 by Dr. Shayan Bakchi and Dr. Onimban Hasra Dr. Shayan Bakchi Bakchi is from Physical and Material Chemistry Division NCL Pune and Dr. Oniban Hajra is from Department of Chemistry Isaac Pune and this is the this is the YouTube link of this reference thank you very much